get going again after the holidays, but really it could be how to get going again after you had a traumatic event that held you back. It could really be how to get going again after you uh, failed or quit in a certain business. Really, it could be any sort of event or period of time that's happened where you take a little bit of time off and then you're trying to figure out how to get going again. So if this is the first time that you've seen a live from me or my wife, my name's Toby. My wife Layla and I have been building online businesses, little digital businesses for the past almost 10 years. We've been, uh, we've been able to go from the basement of a bar to building a multiple six-figure business online in under 14 months. So stick around because I'm going to share something that might be something that you needed to hear in order to get going again. Okay, so make sure if you like this content, share the video. Let me a comment below. If you're on with me live, give me a one. If you're on the replay, give me a two in the comments below and also let me know where you're tuning in from. So I'm not sure if you're, if you're like me, but... I took an extra six days or so after January 1st to reclimatize myself into work mode, so to speak. And it didn't mean that I didn't do things inside my business in order to generate leads, make commissions and whatnot, but I wasn't going at the full capacity. Kind of like when a sports athlete, like a baseball player or a basketball player or a hockey player or a football player or whatever, when they injure themselves, and then they come back from injury, they, the coach, the management team, the physio, they don't immediately throw them back into doing 100% of their workload. What do they do? They ease them back in because they know that if they throw them right in off the deep end right away, then that person is gonna end up either re-injuring themselves or re-burning out. So the same thing is, is, uh, is prevalent in your business and in your life. If you go from taking a couple of days off, a couple of weeks off, and then you jump right back into eight hours a day hammering out your, your business, whatever that may be, network marketing, real estate, affiliate marketing, whatever it is, you're probably going to shock yourself and not in a good way. So one of the things I recommend how to get yourself going again after the holidays. Now, the reason I, I, sh I was decided to shoot this video is because as you can see, I'm red and sweaty. I'm just leaving the gym after dropping uh, our oldest daughter off at school. And uh, it, it was really, uh, I was thinking about the workout that I just did. Now, when I was working out four or five times a week, I was able to do probably quadruple the amount of stuff I was able to do. I was able to run harder and longer. I was able to bench. I was able to uh, deadlift, do all these different things at a much higher capacity because I'd been in the routine. But because I'd taken a few weeks off, or maybe a few months off, uh, I wasn't able to go full out. But what I did was make sure that I eased myself in, but I still pushed myself. So right now in your business, rather than trying to do every single thing under the sun again, why not just start by doing one or two of the most important things? What are one or two of the most important things that make you money? Whether that's shooting video and creating ads, whether that's writing a sales letter, whether that's prospecting, whatever your one or two money-making activity is inside of your business, for the next week, why don't you focus solely on that? Just like with me going to the gym after taking quite a while off, rather than me doing eight machines, bench press, uh, squats, wall sets, deadlifts, rather than me super stacking eight sets of things, I only set five. And rather than me doing five rounds of eight machines, I only did three. And I'll do that for a couple of weeks so I build myself back up so I don't A, oh, injure myself because I'm getting up there and I'm not a spring chicken anymore. And B, I ease myself in so I gradually get back to that place, allowing me to get there more efficiently, actually, uh, and without as much tension and, and sore muscles. So the same thing is in your business. What I would recommend, focus on the one or two most important things that make you the most money. Stick to those for the next seven to 14 days and gradually build in other things. And before you know it, after about 21 days, you will be back into your full routine and hopefully making the, the money that you want and the lifestyle that you want. If you want more information about how Layla and I are able to go to the gym during the day and live a life of freedom, leveraging digital businesses, just give me a comment below 
uh, and ask for our new web class. We have a book and a web class that breaks down everything. All right, I'm out of here, guys. Take care.